The new guy's taking up most of my time, but I think he'll come around. He's been through some serious shit. Hey, with Vance teaching him personally, he's bound to figure it all out soon enough. I wouldn't worry about it, really. See you later. Oh, hey there. I thought I knew everyone in the family, but I don't recognize you. You must be one of Vance's new initiates. My name's Justin. I'm pretty new here myself. Well, Vance told me that this place was called Moresti. It was named after some town way across the ocean in a place called Romania. It's a great way to get back at those assholes out there who think we're losers. If it wasn't for Vance, I'd still be getting the crap beat out of me by those guards in Rivet City. Ian, what do you want from him? I'd never thought of it that way. I suppose he should get a chance to talk to someone like you. Here's the password to his isolation area. Just please don't mention my name to Vance about this. No, just that Vance said he isn't to be disturbed while he's in meditation. Yes, I know. He told me. Surprised? Well, Ian was there when it happened and did nothing to stop it. If you ask yourself why, the answer is obvious. He belongs with us here. He's one of us. Don't deny him his rightful home. I understand. Goodbye. What do you want? I guess I shouldn't be surprised. I'm sure Evan King is pretty pissed right about now. I bet he has the entire town out looking for me. He's worse than my parents. You think I don't know that? You think I don't know what I did? Then you must think I'm some kind of a monster. Help? How can you help? There's something inside me, something completely messed up. I'm a mutant, a fucking freak. The only person I was ever able to talk to was my sister Lucy and she's gone. No one gives a shit about me except Vance and the family. Can't you understand that? She does? If she cared so much, why did she leave when she did? My parents would have never understood. They would have called me a freak and kicked me out. No, I'm sorry. Vance and the family are the only ones that could possibly understand what I'm going through. You know, for a second there, you sounded just like Vance. And you're right. I don't know what I'm running away from, but given time, maybe things can go back to the way they used to be. Please tell Vance I've made my decision. I'm going home to Arfu. I hope to see you there as well. I'm just gonna gather my stuff together and say my goodbyes, then I'll head on back. Are we that different from those who hunt for meat to survive, or for those who kill for territory? Of course not. 
I submit to you that we are the victims of evolution, the next step in mankind's acclamation to this hellish existence. The adaptation we were given wasn't meant to be ignored or persecuted. It's our way of survival. We cannot allow the humans to hunt us down and kill us like dogs. We must show them we are a force to be reckoned with. Well, rest easy now, my brothers and sisters. It's time to stop all of the running, all of the hiding, and all of the denying. We will organize, we will prepare, we will teach you to cope with your differences, and we will keep you alive. We are the family, and together we will stand united. Okay, there, it appears cutie. we have a lot to How's speak it about. Hanging? I trust your talk with young Ian went well. I am quite interested in learning the results of your discussion. Did he come to a decision? As long as you maintain this level of civility, please proceed. Curious. Many years ago, I survived by drinking from fresh blood packs I recovered. The problem was that these blood packs were scarce. What do you propose? Agreed. Please, take this proposal to Arafu. Speak with them and then return to me with their decision. I thank you for showing me that your kind can be trusted after all. It is a lesson I will not forget. Now, what of young Ian? Tell me his decision. It saddens me to lose one of my flock, but I believe everyone has to follow their own path. All I was attempting to do was guide him. Now it seems that responsibility has fallen upon you. I hope you will be more successful. Please, I want you to take this. Consider it as an apology to you for all the hardships you had to endure finding this place. Goodbye, human. Our time together has been rather educational. And great, how are we actually. doing today? I finished my first round of studies great. and Vance said that I was doing great. Always a pleasure. What can I do for you? Come back to us any time. The family considers you a friend. I think no I'm finally beginning to get the hang of it. Huh. I told you. That In bed you were food. mumbling about how you think Look, Vance is all disappointed from your progress. Advice. I Stop knew ignoring he wasn't. the rules and making Vance angry. Well, see you around, he I guess. kicked you out of here. You're Will on him. point. I shall back you oh, up. Oh, hey there. See me again when you, you got the cash, I got the time. I don't think we've been properly introduced. I'm Holly, Vance's wife. This is Moresti, the home of the family. It's the only safe place for these poor people. My husband started this group not long ago. He was trying to save them from a life of hardship and ridicule. They come from all over the wasteland now to find us and become part of the family. It was good talking to you. Hey there, how's it going? Better, I suppose. Well, I think Vance is finally it's calming down after Carl and Holly just for all that trouble. Andy.
please. You just saved my life. I won't forget it. I can't travel yet. But I'll be back on my feet soon, thanks to you. I never expected help from a stranger in the wasteland. There she is, the heroine of the day. I know. I talked to Ian, and he told me everything you did. I don't know how you did it, but goddamn am I glad you walked up that ramp and lent us a hand. Thanks again, kid. Consider yourself welcome back here any time you're in this part of the wastes. Interesting. It seems they wish to enter into some kind of agreement. I guess it's better than pointing my gun down that ramp all day and hiding inside at night. Let Vance know he's got a deal. We'll do it. I'll speak to the others. I'm sure they'll agree with me. I've been saving up stuff for emergencies, in case things with Arafu got tremendously bad. You're welcome to some of it if you like. Come on back soon. I may have some stuff for you. What's up, Wastelanders? This is Three Dog Bow Wow, and you're listening to GNR. That's Visit or to patch yourself up.
Well, hello again. You need something smooth, Skin? And not a moment too soon. I didn't expect you to bring back so much. That'll set me up for quite some time. So what'd you have in mind for payment? 25 bits of scrap metal for me, five stim packs for you. It's been a pleasure doing business. Can you pay me? Then I can repair your stuff. Let me know if you have any of that scrap metal to sell. I've got just the thing for you. Do you want to see it? Please say yes. If any of the armor fails to protect your life, I'll give you a full refund. Another satisfied custom. Come back soon, please. It's locked for a reason. Don't get any ideas. It's been a while. What have you been up to? 